So, um, I wasn't aware of this, but I just now got the Noble M600. I know nothing about that car, so let's see what happens. Yes, I got it. Like my, like my pink, my pink R200. Yeah, Noble time. Okay, what kind of price is this? Because, like... Noble was some guy. I know that. Noble was a guy who created nitroglycerin or something. Some kind of explosive. <laughs> Can't fucking remember. He made shit go boom. Um, and then he realized that maybe shit going boom doesn't actually help the world maybe some people make shit go boom in a bad way mm. so then he created a Nobel prizes or something <laughs> i honestly don't know okay what what kind of engine is in here actually i can just google okay so this is a hand-built British sports car manufactured by low-volume automobile manufacturer Noble Automotive in Leicestershire. Leicestershire, yeah. Uh, it uses a Volvo slash Yamaha V8 engine. Twin turbocharged. Huh. Why would you we want to change that? That is cool as shit. Uh, okay, e even though that is cool as fuck, like, let's be honest, this is, oh, it's rear wheel drive, yeah, you can see that, um, this is, oh wait, what kind of upgrades can we do, diesel, 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 oh, but that isn't any fun. What can we do with the existing engine? Oh, I forgot how rich I am. Sure, let's let's waste a bunch of money. Let's waste a bunch of money. Let's make this the bestest noble that there can be. Hell yeah. Huh? Yeah? That makes everything worse. Okay. Um, whoops. Fuck. I know how things work. I'm not dumb. I promise. Eight kilos lighter. Those are the lightest thing. Like, how are these so much heavier than these? 16 kilos difference. How? Okay. Track width. Makes our off-roading better. But our handling worse. Okay. Any Anything fun we can shove on it? Nah. Not really. Um... Stopping is good. Um, drift suspension. You can actually do off road. You know what? Fuck it. Off road. We're we're gonna do an off road build. We we are gonna do an off road build. Uh, where are you? Off road race compound tire. And then this is better for off roading. We have eight in off roading. Oh. uh... Yeah, I made it all-wheel drive just a second ago, didn't I? No, I did not. That's gonna make our off-roading go down. Uh-huh. Off-road diff, is that... It can have an off-road diff, but there are SUVs that can't. Yeah, um... Where do we get the best stats? We get all of the same stats. So let's take a race transmission. Because I like customizability. More handling, less off-roading. Do you think a wing... A wing makes us more off-road. So does this. Sure. <laughs> Ah, oh, this is gonna be crazy. Okay, so we go from 662. Nah. It's not really that important. We're, we're just gonna off-road. Like normal people. 
Um, from 19 to 20. Okay. Um, install the setup. For 50,000 credits, we've made an off-roading machine. Okay. Okay. Very interesting. Very interesting. Let's actually test it off-road, though. So, let's do... Let's tail to you, uh, uh, scramble. <laughs> so, um... C five hundred. Oh, wow, the Colorado is actually better than the Rapture. Um, Noble. I'm gonna pick the Nor Noble. It was it was actually recommended. It was on the second page of recommended. Nobody ever goes there, but um, I do. I do. Cause I'm absolutely crazy. <laughs> GT40 Like, okay, so my the, the engine in my car comes from a Volvo more specifically They put it in the XC90 and I think also the S80 But they put it in the XC90 and Volvos they make tractors. I'm pretty sure and trucks like semi trucks so I come so my heart is a fucking truck and then your heart is a Ford. <laughs> Ford doesn't make like 45 different types of trucks. Nope. Mm. Fucking loser in your GT40. Mm. Die, motherfuckers. Okay, um. What oh, shit, a Corvette? Yeah? Oh, you're fucking with me. Come on, I could have fucking saved that. Come on, look at this. This is how you save that. By simply not letting random things control your vehicle, I don't fucking know. Oh, torch there. I think the, that there has been changes in my fucking hell that my steering wheel has somehow changed settings because like whoa ah. because like <laughs> gtr this is so wacky uh we soon we shakes a lot about for no reason um fucking hell oh yeah this is this is what I hate about sports car. This, the weight distribution is off and just dumb. Huh? At least if you're gonna go off-roading. But I don't think they optimized this car for off-roading. Something, something tells me that maybe at the Noble factory, they did not think that somebody was gonna go off-roading with this. But they should have. Like, these people are smart, right? They should have understood that some people want to go off-roading in their low production v it Oh, you bitches. The NPCs absolutely shove me around. I do repay them the favor, but that's only because they're assholes first. We've been assholes since day one. Well, I at least have tried to be kind to them. Bruh. Imagine, imagine if you could actually see where the fucking flags are. God damn it! Could you fucking imagine? Look at that. My technique is so beautiful. Huh? Fucking want to get in the front and get in the front. That was what I fucking thought. Damn, I'm doing so bad. <laughs> um. Ooh. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Off-roading in this game is awful. Oh, that fucking... Half a meter. So after all of this, I'm half a meter away. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there we go. Wow. Actually want to go where I point you. That gives you points. That place too much points. Oh, yeah. Whew. 
driving off road in this game not the best and also did you see that I got that point I got that checkpoint it, the game was like yeah that's a valid checkpoint bruh sometimes you can pull so much bullshit and other times it's like no you were you were four atoms away that means you failed four atoms is four atoms too much it's not even close and now is the part where the NPCs just absolutely ram my ass because I'm slowing down god damn this game is wacky as shit and I'm gonna end up in sixth Whoa. look at that it's an absolutely perfect technique bruh Whoever put that tree there? I fuck nature. Nature? More like fucking nature. Fucking hell. Yeah? Mm hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Boom. So good driving happening right fuck now. Listen to my. My steering wheel is. <laughs> Hold up. It's my. <laughs> Why? Why is my steering wheel doing that? That's quite a lot of force feedback. Oh, jeez. Fucking hell. Let's go. Fucking hell. Crushing all the motherfucking competition. Holy fucking shit. Competition equals fucking crushed. Do you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna restart the race just to flex on everybody once again that I'm the greatest motherfucking driver that there ever has been and ever fucking will be. I get, but to be fair, even though I beat everybody, obviously, it's kind of it's kind of unfair because like this guy is a hundred levels above. Oh wait, this is Forza. Nothing really matters. Wait, he got a hundred wheel spins more than me. Oh shit, that's why I lost. Uh, no, he lost, I mean, yeah. I'm not in denial, you're in denial. Okay, I managed to get the first. I didn't want to drag y'all with me, because it would probably take a long time, I thought, so of course I managed it on the second try. Second try is one try too many. Fucking hell. I just need to cock block him, bitch ass fucker! Oh my fucking god! Hmm? 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 Try to fuck with me? What a fucking dark bitch! I just showed the middle finger to my rear, like behind. Fucking up, behind me. I I just shoved, showed my wall the middle finger because I imagine it being. Rudy Grimm. <laughs> I really hope Rudy's a bot. <laughs> but yay. Rudy, if you're not a bot, I'm sorry. Because you were a pain in the ass. Because you were a good ass driver. Hey yo. That sign says tall. I know Spanish. That's, that sign says tall. It does not say stop. <laughs> Bruh. Uh, oh, fuck. Anyway, anyways, anyways. This is surprisingly good off-road. This was so much fun to do, actually. Because, like, I was about to say several times in this video, um, during the tuning, like, well, let's test it, because, like, wow, a mid-engined V8 rear-wheel drive supercar. The game doesn't have any of those. Not at all, no, this is very rare. And there's a point in engine swapping it. Because there's not already millions of videos online of that happening to similar cars. Um, but yeah, no, actually going off-road was really funny. Really fun. It was really fun. It was a little funny at times, a little wacky. One time I ended upside down, but you didn't see that. But trust me. Anyways, yeah, I really fucking enjoyed making this video. And I really hope you fucking enjoyed watching it. 
because if not, I wasted my time. But until I see you again, uh, see ya.